Hello everybody, welcome to Smiley Kids. In this video, we are going to take a quiz on matter in our surroundings, class 9, quiz part 2. Before that, subscribe to our channel, Smiley Kids. And don't forget to click on the bell icon for all the updates. Let's begin our quiz. Question number 1. A form of matter that has a fixed volume but it has no fixed shape is your options are solid liquid gas all of the above your time starts now Your time is up and the correct answer is liquid. Liquids have no fixed shape but have fixed volume. They take up the shape of the container in which they are kept. So our answer is liquid. Question number two. Dry ice is. Your options are. Solid carbon dioxide, liquid carbon dioxide, gas carbon dioxide, liquid water. Your time starts now. Your time is up and the correct answer is solid carbon dioxide solid carbon dioxide is called dry ice it is stored at very high pressure so our answer is solid carbon dioxide question number three dash have the highest kinetic energy your options are solid liquid gas both A and B, that is solid and liquid. Your time starts now. Your time is up. And the correct answer is gas. Gases have the highest kinetic energy. Question number 4. During summer, water kept in an earthen pot, that is matka, becomes cool because of. Your options are melting, condensation, deposition, evaporation. Your time starts now. Your time is up and the correct answer is evaporation. During summer, water kept in an earthen pot, matka, becomes cool because of the process evaporation. Question number 5. The value of 30 degrees Celsius in Kelvin is? Your options are 303, 293, 273, 243. Your time starts now. Your time is up and the correct answer is 303. To convert the temperature in Celsius to the Kelvin, we need to add 273. So, when we add 
hundred seventy three to thirty, we get three hundred three. That is our answer in Kelvin. So the value of thirty degree Celsius in Kelvin is three hundred three Kelvin. Question number six. Which of the following substance undergoes sublimation? Your options are ice, common salt, sugar, naphthalene. Your time starts now. Your time is up and the correct answer is naphthalene. You might have observed naphthalene balls as a solid state. After some time they disappear because the solid state is being changed to the gaseous state directly without undergoing the liquid state. So this process is called sublimation. That is why our answer is naphthalene. Whereas Ice, common salt, sugar, all should be changed to the liquid state, then they convert into the gaseous state. Okay, so our answer for this is naphthalene, which undergoes the sublimation. Question number seven. Dash state is obtained by cooling a gas extremely low density to super low temperatures. Your options are plasma, BEC that is Bose-Einstein condensate state, solid, liquid. Your time starts now. Your time is up. And the correct answer is BEC, Bose-Einstein condensate state, is obtained by cooling a gas extremely low density to the super low temperatures. Question number 8. Which of the following statement is correct? Your options are only gases behave like fluids, only liquids behave like fluids, Gases and liquids behave like fluids. Solids and gases behave like fluids. Your time starts now. Your time is up and the correct answer is Gases and liquids behave like fluids. So this statement is correct. Only gases and liquids behave like fluids. Question number 9. The boiling point of water at sea level is? Your options are 0 degree Celsius, 273 Kelvin, 373 Kelvin, 273 degrees Celsius. Your time starts now. Your time is up and the correct answer is 373 Kelvin because the boiling point of water is 100 degree Celsius. When we convert 100 degree Celsius to Kelvin, that is 100 plus 273, we get 373 Kelvin. So the boiling point of water at sea level is 373 Kelvin. Question number 10. The quantity of matter present in an object is called its your options are mass, volume, density, space. Your time already started. Your time 
your time is up and the correct answer is mass the quantity of matter present in an object is called as mass it's very easy question number 11 what type of clothes should we wear in summer your options are nylon silk woolen cotton your time starts now your time is up and the correct answer is cotton we should wear cotton clothes in summer because cotton is a good absorber of water that is sweat and it exposes it to the atmosphere for easy evaporation so our answer is cotton question number 12 which of the following causes the temperature of a substance to remain constant while it is undergoing a change in its state your options are latent heat lattice heat low heat loss of heat your time starts now your time is up and the correct answer is latent heat latent heat is the hidden heat in an object so this causes the temperature of a substance to remain constant while it is undergoing a change in its state so our answer is latent heat question number 13 when heat is constantly supplied by burner to the boiling water then the temperature of water during vaporization is your options are rises very slowly first rises and then becomes constant does not rise at all rises rapidly your time starts now your time is up and the correct answer is does not rise at all when heat is constantly supplied by a burner to the boiling water the temperature of this water will not rise at all question number 14 the minimum temperature at which a solid melts to become a liquid at the atmospheric pressure is called its your options are boiling point melting point freezing point none of the above your time starts now your time is up and the correct answer is melting point solid melts to become a liquid at a minimum temperature this is called melting point question number 15 the rate of evaporation increases with your options are decrease in humidity decrease in wind speed decrease of temperature decrease of surface area your time starts now your time is up and the correct answer is decrease in humidity 
There are four factors which affect the rate of evaporation. They are surface area, humidity, temperature, wind speed. Temperature, wind speed, surface area should be increased to increase the rate of evaporation. Whereas humidity should be decreased. So decrease in humidity increases the rate of evaporation. Thank you all. Hope you like this video. Of course, show your love by clicking on the like button. Please share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe our channel, Smiley Kids.